we got another package here let's see what we got this is the Technet EVAC charger another charger for the cars for the electric cars let's see what we got here I don't remember this one to be honest so it comes in a nice little bag to take it away when you're not using it and there it is I've been getting a lot of these portable ones. I'm wondering if you can install this permanently, permanently, because what I did here, I replaced a fixed one that I had here, but it was hardwired. Now I have this 240 outlet here. So maybe we can install this kind of permanently, semi-permanently, let's see. So I can install a holder, the actual little box doesn't go there. Maybe it does. Yeah, it does. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try this one. So here's the whole user manual. It actually doesn't have mounting instructions, but it's pretty simple. Let me see here the parts. So this part goes here, let's say, for the actual unit, or the opposite, it doesn't matter really. This one goes to put the wire and you can connect here. I'm going to take these screws off and see if by any luck we're aligned. I don't think so. So that's it. That's not going anywhere now. We're connected. A little bit of a mess, but that's the installation for now. That's the good thing about these portable chargers. You can put them anywhere, take them off, bring them with you. So here it is now. Now we need an EV car. Because a Lamborghini is not electric. So as you saw, I had a Lamborghini, which is not electric. Now I have this Volkswagen ID4, which has 22% of 48 pounds of range. So we're gonna charge it for a little bit and see how effective is this Technic EV AC charger. Here are just the light indicator guide, and here are the numbers. So it's gonna charge at 240 volts it can charge at 110 to 60 hertz the output of the actual charger is 32 amps and you can work in humidity condensation whatever so let's go and do it it's also an app that you can download and uh, program your charging if you want so you can do that when you get your own unit this is again not my car and i'm not gonna do the app for now so here we are let's see there's the port, there's our charger, on as you can see 243 volts, I will check the amp when we connect. There's the green light, it's charging now, 241 volts, 31.5 amps, and let's see what the actual car is telling us. There it is, it's charging 24 miles an hour, so pretty good. It will be charged by 1041. I don't have that time because I'm living on a trip. So I'm gonna leave it here for an hour or two and we'll see what we get. So here we are, it's been a little bit over an hour now. I don't have too much time to do it for longer so let's see what we got here okay 36 percent 86 miles that's pretty good for an hour and 20 minutes so that's really really good i like it let's take it off that's it let's return the cart to its owners oh. 
done with this car. Goodbye, Charles. So the beauty of this charger is, again, that this is portable. So I can close this. We can take it for the next trip.